What's up guys? It is time to leave the trailer and go fishing. Brookie and I are going to fish an inlet where there we have the potential to catch browns, splake, lake trout, rainbow trout. I think that's it. There's kokanee there as well. Sometimes they'll take your fly, sometimes they're busy dying. But um, the goal is to catch some splake, rainbows, browns if we can catch them and yeah this is a really really big lake with a little inlet where the fish tend to come in this time of year so i'm really excited to go fish let's okay. go do it nobody is gonna believe me i don't know how or why this thing just ate because he's clearly dying but he did look how cool he is my first kokanee one let's see if i can get one on the gopro You guys, I just lost what I was after, which was a solid red one that actually ate my tiny little midge, and I lost him because it was the most subtle eat. I didn't really think he did, so I did a half good hook set, and he came off after a couple minutes. Let's see if I can get another one like him. Okay, I think I just hooked a good brown. It is not a kokanee. Definitely a solid brown. See if I can land them. Is it a brown? It's something. Might be a lake trout or splake. I don't know. It, I think it's a good splake. Oh my gosh, I think it's a really good splake. Oh my gosh, I'm nervous. This is light line. Oh my god. Oh, I can't believe I caught that. I'm so glad that splake ate. That was pretty cool, not what I was expecting. Lots of times browns and splake will hang out here by the kokanee in the fall. Just at this little inlet, they all like running water if they're getting ready to spawn. Fly looks pretty silver and it's very spunky, so I don't think it's a kokanee. Let's see what it is. Looks like it's a good size. Holy cow, it's really spunky. It's bright silver from what I can see. Whoa. Every time I bring it in, it takes my line. Oh, what is it? It's a rainbow, I think. Whoa, oh my gosh. It just took like 20 yards of line. <laughs> it's not even that big a rainbow, it's just a really spunky one. Whoa. Easy, buddy. Easy, buddy, whoa. Come on, let me get you in and get you up. I'm a catch and release kind of gal. That is a good rainbow. Okay, check him out. Gonna let him go. He took a midge. Okay, I don't know if the GoPro got catching that one. I don't know why the hell he ate. He's pretty much dead. Let him go. Go ahead, buddy. It's crazy I wasn't gonna come here. It's like two o'clock. 
worst time of the day. I'm so glad I came. It's been so fun. Already caught splake, kokanee, and rainbows. I think I might have just hooked a good red one. Let's see. I think so. Feels like dead weight. Oh, he came off. That's okay. They take them so subtly. It's pretty hard to hook set them. I'll get some more. Okay, pray for me. I just hooked my dream kokanee. Full red, full spawn, not dying, and he's big. This is not going to be easy. Oh my gosh, he's got a big old humpback. Pookie! Pookie's kind. Let's get him, Mom. Oh, come on. They have big teeth and I'm on light line. I'm gonna let them tire out. Rookie! It's okay. Let me bring you in. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Oh, he barely fits in my net. Holy, oh my God. Look at this, you guys. Oh my God. He took a mid. Look at the size of him. How am I supposed to get this out of your teeth? Stop it. Oh my God, that was a lucky. Huck said it was just on the side of his mouth. Look at that. He's so pretty. Take a deep breath, buddy. Look at his mouth. Look at that hump. There, there he goes. Go on, buddy. There he goes. Nice and steady. Dang. Yeah, when they're spawning, they're using a lot of energy, just like a deer during the rut. So you really need to give them a lot of time holding them and moving them back and forth like in the water like I did. But now he's off. What do you think about that mean looking fish, huh, Brookie? That was so cool, huh? That was so cool. He was so mean looking. All right, let's catch some more. I've been in the water too much and cold. I'd like to get some more and then go to another spot for the evening. All right, let's see if I can catch one more fish. I'm really, really cold. Hands have caught in a lot of fish. I'm very cold. And I've gotten pretty wet wrestling that big kokanee in, so. We'll see if I can get any more. I'm curious, like, this is my first time catching kokanee. Have you guys caught them when they're, like, so decrepit? <laughs> like, I'm so surprised they're eating, I swear. Please tell me, I would love to know. Hey, let me go. Well, I'm so glad I did that. That was so much fun. Lots of tourists here today, but that's but I can't okay. believe how many fish I caught. It was so dang fun. Like, I, I had a blast. My face is a little dirty. Um, that was so much fun. So, splake, rainbow, bunch of kokanee. All in, all in just like a quick drive and like, let me take a couple casts here. And like I said, I tried for kokanee for the past two years and both times failed to get them. I always said they were too busy dying to eat my flies. Today I found some that weren't too busy dying to eat flies. And it was because I used nymphs. So, 
in the past I was trying some crazy things that were recommended to me either as a lie or something who knows there's a bunch of fish eating right there little though little tiny babies but um yeah that was so much fun I'm glad I went with my gut feeling which was Kokanee will eat nymphs during the year. Kokanee will eat nymphs out of habit even when they're spying. And sure enough, they did. And it was so fun. Right, Brooke? Brooke? This is what she comes for. Brookie, you were a good girl. Good fishing kitty gets treats. Thank you so much for watching that video. I still can't get over how excited I am that I finally caught some kokanee on my fly rod. And not only that, I really think that was a fine specimen of a kokanee. What do you guys think? You know, this isn't Alaska, this is Utah, so kokanee aren't our priority here, you know? But they are good for a lot of things, and I'm so glad I caught that one. And he was just so cool. The prime male kokanee specimen. I'm glad Brookie was there for it, too. <laughs> but I really want to say thank you for watching the video. Stay tuned. Uh, I think there's going to be a video tomorrow and probably the next day. So definitely stay tuned. If you're not already, please subscribe and ring that little bell so you get notifications when I post. That would be awesome because there's some giveaways coming up. So you want to stay tuned. Thanks so much, guys. We'll see you next time.